something like this to happen is really close to home. New documents from New Mexico State Police paint a grim picture of a scene in Nambe, north of Santa Fe. A search warrant affidavit filed in Santa Fe District Court says state police found a car registered to a woman named Elvira Segura abandoned in Las Cruces two weeks ago. Officers decided to check out Segura's home in Nambe. The search warrant affidavit says state police found a crack window much like this one. They made their way inside and were horrified by what they found. Flies all over the house, a strong odor from inside, blood splatters on the walls, and the corpses of a woman and a dog. A doctor who performed the autopsy on the woman says she'd likely been there for weeks and was so decomposed that they've not yet been able to confirm who she is. Neighbors with children say they're scared. We don't let them out uh, on their own unless somebody's supervising them. Neighbors told state police agents that Segura lived at the home with a man they only knew as Bob and that they'd heard gunshots coming from the house three weeks before. Their description matched that of the man witnesses say they saw abandoned Segura's car in Las Cruces. They say Bob held a yard sale, likely while the woman was dead inside. Reporting in Nambe, David Carl, KOAT Action 7 News. And state police are still looking for that Bob, also known as Robert Mondrian Powell or Robert Boykin. They say he may have ties to the Las Cruces, El Paso area. If you know where he is, call state police. Thanks.